2014 was the year when digital music rose. Soon, internet hip hop stars will pop out one after another. Welcome to Major Key Unlimited. What hip hop in 2014 looked like. In today's video, we will walk you through the top hip hop artists of 2014 that marked a big stamp and proved the year was indeed a hip hop year. Make sure to watch till the end. Only a few are lucky to have the support of our cousins that stand with us during hard times. This goes to Future and his cousin Rico Wade, who's a member of the Dungeon family and Organized Noise. He encouraged the latter to sharpen his writing skills and made him leave the street life by becoming a great rapper. Throughout his career, Future always credited his cousin by calling him the mastermind behind his voice. Coupled with Future's extraordinary talent, four of his songs from his second album, Honest, managed to jump on the US Billboard Hot 100, Karate Chop, Honest, Move the Dope, and I Won. Although some controversy arose concerning his I Won single about the song's actual meaning, which in the video shows Future's fiance as his trophy wife. But in an interview, he clearly stated that I Won is not a love song. I am trying to give power to the women through the song to treat themselves as trophies because when they do that, whoever they are with always wins. Remarkably, the song grabbed the 98th position on the U.S. Billboard Hot 100 within a few days after its release. Wiz Khalifa had a rough life before beginning his music career. Born in a military family, his parents divorced when he was only three years old. So he was forced to move from one country to another, Germany, United Kingdom, and Japan. Because of his mother's work, after settling in Pittsburgh, he began performing his songs. And at the age of 15, when a music studio named ID Labs got impressed by his work, they offered him to record for free. His granddad called him Khalifa because he was good at whatever he did. It seems that his granddad gave him a perfect name because when Wiz decided to release his fifth studio album named Black Hollywood, his song Weedem Boys skyrocketed beyond everyone's expectations. Wiz wanted this song to be the first single because of the energy and the level of connection it manages to create. It's even acknowledged more like an anthem. Eventually, the song grabbed the 43rd position on the US Billboard Hot 100 and gave a big push to his career. It is hard to not have the love of parents at a very young age. Cole's father left his mother at a very young age. Keeping his spirit strong, Cole moved on with his life and met his perfect life partner when his mother gifted him an ASR-10 musical sampler during Christmas. Cole soon exploited all his opportunities and began writing songs and practicing wordplay after getting inspired by Eminem and Nas. After the launch of his third album, 2014 Forest Hill Drive, his determination became a life changer. Two of his songs topped the music charts, apparently became the best rap performance of the 2016 Grammys and reached the 17th position on the hip hop songs chart. Wet Dreams was certified platinum by the RIAA. 2014 Forest Hill Drive went on to sell over a million copies, making it certified platinum. Most notable, it had no features on this album. But what do you think? What was the most remarkable hip hop event in 2014? Let us know in the comment section below. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe so you don't miss an upload and you can continue to enjoy the excellent content we send your way. Again, I'm Five Weeks Beats. Until next time.